Hey, my vloggers and people that are watching this channel, sorry if uh, the lighting is a little dark. It's getting dark out, and uh, it's because it's monsoon season out here in the desert. It uh, does seem to get overcast a lot, so which is good because the heat is pretty intense sometimes. But um, I have something right here in my hands. It's a very new purchase. Uh, you get to see a little bit more of that, of course. Uh, as you guys know, if you follow this uh, vlog channel, you guys get first hand on what uh, what is new, what what we're uh, what we're purchasing, and what's coming up to the channel. So you get to uh, get first hand and seeing it. Um, although, if you'll notice uh, this coming up, JW's radio on Saturday, that uh, there's actually a picture of a little picture of this this beautiful fine firearm. It's actually not something. Um, I actually own one, believe it or not, but uh, I don't own one like this, if you can believe that. But uh, lately, also, what I've, I bought a new knife, and these are interesting. Um, it's an Italian-style stiletto. These are complete knockoff knives. They're knocked off. Uh, they're made in China, they, although they don't say made in China. But uh, and this one, as you can see, yes, that's quite a knife. <laughs> I love this thing. I paid twenty-seven dollars for this. And they are, just like I said, they're knockoff knives. And what quality? Uh, it actually, let's put it this way, the quality of this thing has made me afraid to go to gun shows and actually pay big bucks for the Italian ones because in reality, there is no telling this apart. You really can't tell the difference uh, in this one and some of the Italian ones. You really can't. I'm telling you right now. Uh, it's a really good copy. So for things like that, with uh, Santee and I do uh, for skits and things, you'll be seeing these things pop up in there. In there, because I always felt like on on camera, on video, like uh, how they they captivated me watching a lot of movies. They really do show up, and they just photograph really nice. And always just <laughs> yes, it is a a 13 inch uh, stiletto knife. No kidding, 27 bucks. So. Anyhow, today uh, I was I went down today and finally made the uh, purchase on this uh, new rifle I acquired. I was um, courting around with it last week. I saw it for the first time last week at uh, my friend's shop down here, uh, my friend uh, Frontier Firearms down here in Grant. And uh, I really, I just I saw this thing and I fell in love with it. And I knew I told him I said I got to have this thing. So uh, what do we got to do? And he said he had just acquired it too. So he said, Oh, let me. Uh, Go do the uh, proper things. I got to test fire, make sure it works, and all that stuff. So, and uh, what what is it? What are we talking about? Yes, three minutes into the video, you are definitely curious. It is a Rossi 62 pump action, but you might notice something about this one. It's the carbine model. It's rather short. Yes, look at that. I can get it all the way in the frame right there. It's a short little gun. It's a 16 inch barrel, and it's kind of really neat because. The magazine tube and barrel meet up, unlike my other one. My other one is a, I believe it's a 23-inch barrel. So this one here is, uh, yeah, nice little carbine. Now this one will shoot the uh, shorts, longs, and long rifle. It does have the cartridge stop in it. I'll show you what I mean. The having the cartridge stop is really important if you're gonna have one of these things see here I don't know if you'll see it but there's a uh, right there is a cartridge stop and that is what allows this thing to shoot the shorts longs or any anything basically under a long rifle it'll gauge it and tell it to stop and not have any of the other cartridges come up and interrupt it so that's really neat so I've been kind of horsing around with this thing uh, but it's really cool and that is the takedown so as if it needs to be any shorter, really. So isn't that just sweet? So you guys get to first see it right here uh, on the uh, vlog channel. Nice corn cob style slide or pump. They actually call these slide actions. Uh, it's called like a 62 sack, S-A-C, nothing. But uh, this is a, definitely an older Rossi. I wish they would uh, make these still some more. Uh, they're also known as the gallery guns. Uh, people used to try to shoot out the little red dot on the paper 
and they always would find some speck of red. As my uncle back home says, they always break out the magnifier and, <laughs> and find a little shred of that red dot still left. So that's pretty, pretty cool. Pretty vintage uh, rifle. These things are not uh, on the expensive end, but they're not easy to find sometimes. They uh, get kind of rare in trying to find one. Most people scoop them up as I scooped up two myself. So that's the second one I own. Uh, it's an absolute fun rifle. A friend of mine uh, back where I used to work told me about them. And ever since then, I absolutely just had to have one. So I, <laughs> I know what he means by, he told me, he says, if you ever get one, don't ever let it go. And I know what he means because in fact, I've done the opposite. Instead of letting it go, I bought another one. <laughs> so that makes two uh, 62 pumps of Rossi's. And um, yeah, we're still counting, right? <laughs> so that's the new firearm for Batjack JW. Still working on some other things in the back, uh, on the back burner. And you'll be seeing those on the main channel. And of course, here first, because you're tuned into JW's vlog channel. That's Batjack JW Radio Show right here on this channel. So keep watching, keep staying tuned, and thanks for uh, checking it out.